Well, no, when we look at the MAC, <laughs> a surprise is undefeated. Akron, yeah. how are they doing it? Well, they're undefeated in conference play, and and that just goes to show you that you really can't measure uh, a MAC level team, Sun Belt, all these conferences below the five uh, Power Five conferences. You really can't measure them by non-conference play. You know, they lost to Penn State. Yes. They lost to, to uh, Iowa State, which has proven to be a much better team than, than what was initially thought. They lost to Troy, who beat LSU, which mm -hmm. was in the top 25. And so they're, they're uh, one and three. They beat their one double H. So they're one and three, you know, to start the th season. And you're thinking same old Akron. Right. But those teams that they played are 14 and four, I believe. Now you get into the MAC against comparable competition. And now all of a sudden they look a whole lot better. They're they're number one in conference play only. Okay, they're number one in pass defense efficiency, number one in interception, number two in sacks, number one in uh, number two in turnover margin, number one in red zone efficiency on offense, and number one in red zone efficiency on defense. That's how they're winning. They're playing against teams that they're comparable with, even though Western Michigan ran all over them. Okay like a herd of buffalo <laughs> on Saturday. They kept them out of the end zone. And that's the, that's and, the whole and that, key. That's the whole key. Plus, as I've said all season long, they got the most veteran quarterback in the league. And as long as he's not losing games, you, you got a chance to win. And right now, they're, they're on track to be bowl eligible. Well, hold that thought on the bowl eligible. I, I want to go these games quickly this week. Eastern at Western, yep. uh, Buffalo at Miami, yep. and Akron at Toledo. Now, now, the one thing about the MAC, being bowl eligible is the key thing. Oh, that's huge. W which school I is mean, in jeopardy of that? Uh, all, you know, uh, you, you, Eastern Michigan better start winning. They're only two and I think they're two and uh, two and four or two and five. So East, if they want to be bowl eligible and go to a bowl game, they got to they got to go four and two to end the season. Buffalo is three and four. You know, in order to be bowl eligible, let's backtrack a little bit. You got to be at least 500, okay. which is six wins, six and six. But to be safe, you better have seven. <laughs> but to at least claim bowl eligibility, you got to be 500, six and six. Buffalo's three and four. That means they got to win three more games going down the stretch. Miami's two and five. You know, they probably right. can't get there, but they got to somehow try and hold up pace. Akron, while they're undefeated in the league, they still got to close out strong to 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 uh, become bowl eligible. So all of these games here, the next two or three weeks, these are huge. Um, you know, for the MAC to get four, five, six teams bowl eligible and play in the postseason. 